How's it going, YouTube? Today we got for you a Madden 18 online game. I mean, these are more fun than Ultimate Team right now, in my opinion, because you're actually able to play with some some stars. Unless you're, you're forking over the money to get these elites. As of right now, the star of my team is... Well, the toss-up of either long shot Dan Marino or long shot Chad Johnson or Mark Ingram for my offense and then I got Deion Sanders from that goat pack as you guys saw but I mean it's not not extremely fun as of right now I gotta do more challenges this video actually came out so much longer than I anticipated because I was like Sure, I'll just get the little quick video. We'll just get it down there. And it's so long. And I was like, was the game even that long? And I, like, I cut stuff out. And it still happened to be so long. So I don't understand what happened. But this is a video of why you see Tyler Lockett mean mugging somebody for at least 10 seconds. This guy took... I stress you not. He took at least 20 seconds to call any play. Like, every play was going to be a banger. That's what he felt. So he would just take his sweet time. And he was like, man, I could just call this play and win the game right here. Offense or defense. And he just took his time and really evaluated his plays. It was really sad. Well, it's not sad to do that, I guess. But it's sad that that's not the outcome that happened. Like, see, I, I shut, like, I grouped a lot of these together, and I just showed plays for some, some of it, and, uh, how did he drop that? And it's still just, it's still a super long video, because this guy took so long in between plays. And in this game, I am terrible at defense. Terrible. I mean, I played decent in this game, but in this game here, I mean, but like in just Madden 18 in general, I am so bad at defense, but the user is like, I mean, if you're in the right spot, you're going to catch the ball as opposed to like, like, let's say like last gen or like even up to like Madden 25 or anything like that if you're in the same area that doesn't mean you're gonna get the pick in well, this game it's i feel like it's a little easier but they do have that perfect timing user pick and the late timing where you will drop it and stuff like that but i've never come into the the bad side of that yet which i'm thankful for Almost a pick by Tremaine Brock. I was actually really surprised they had Tremaine Brock as the, the second string. I'm not sure if he is right now. Like, I don't think they're going to start the season that way, but maybe they will. They were talking about putting Jeremy Lane on that side earlier, and that was the last I heard of it. And now Tremaine Brock is the second string in the game. I also thought Deshaun Shedd was going to be, but I understand he's hurt. But, like, I thought he was going to come back into that rotation but they have him on special teams at one point in this game and then he's just I don't know is he is he still like hurt is he out of the rotation because he's hurt or is he just out of the rotation not understanding I thought he was pretty good and here I try to get Thomas Rawls going because once you get Thomas Rawls going the game has just become so much easier because he's he's just a beast. This is the run I needed. And I show both there and I get tackled at the one. I was so sad when I didn't get this touchdown right here. Like, honestly, I didn't know how to feel. Because <laughs> I thought I had it free. I thought I could start showboating, but... Get in with Wilson, even though it looks like he doesn't. And he fell, and he put the ball behind him for some reason. He 
with the addition of Blair Walsh this year, I don't know how to feel. I mean, he was winning games for us before he even played with us with the Vikings game. But, I mean, that's not necessarily a good resume to go off of. And then he had that terrible season, like, what was it, last year, the year before? And we got rid of house money for him because Hoshka missed those, those key field goals. An example, the Cardinal game. But he's been good for a lot of years, so I don't, I don't get it. Somehow Sherman made that tackle. I was looking at that run and I was like, touchdown. And then Sherman literally just like slid towards him. And then he somehow tripped up his foot. That was an amazing tackle by Sherman, I guess. This is basically this guy's offense. And there's a lot of missed tackles by me. And yeah. <laughs> you know, so far, I really can't figure this guy out. I can't tell if he wants to run the ball more than he throws. Seems more like a, a run, run, play action kind of guy. But, hmm, trying to fill this guy out so far. Um, wow, Tremaine got that destroyed over there. And thank God he did not look at X, because that would have been a for sure touchdown. I'm just trying to throw him different looks right now, see what he does. So far, he hasn't been able to really capitalize. He could have capitalized on that one, though. Or he, he just like the wrong read there. And they found Charles Clay, but can found something there to thankfully knock the ball out. That's very well timed there defensively because it's not a bad throw, but the there is in. This is usually like a solid money play, so I want to see if I can figure that out. Really, really well done. Decent offense, just better defense. I think you're right. This offense was on the move. Now two straight in completions. Have a look at it. Third and ten. Five. Bottled up by Sherman. Inside the thirty to about the twenty-nine, maybe the twenty-eight yard line. And see, there's the Sean Shed. Like, I was talking about the Sean Shed earlier, and I said I'm not sure what he is, because he's a special team player in the but he's not the corner. I mean, he's playing right now, but I'm not sure exactly what he's doing. And he gets blocked. Partner, I think they saw something there. I mean, they came from the right side I mean, deliberately, and you know there's always team, a designated guy team, who goes and blocks it. But, like but it's corners. the rest of it. Jeremy Lane is also a corner option, but he's again not playing corner. Tremaine Brock is a new pickup. I'm very confused on how that works. I don't know if that's the rotation or not. The ball's gone. I honestly don't know what Dolphins. Speed is without some team bridges. This is a nice game. I'm not trying to notice that I'm not sure what the run maybe the defense caught napping a little bit. The concentration level may not have been there. I agree with you on that one because pieces. those types of plays, when they result like that, they're almost like big bolts of lightning, aren't they? Kind of like Whoosh, and off he goes. Here's Walsh now to kick this one off. That was all game. And Let's this will be a... Part. He'll start on the ground with McCoy. And he'll go down right at the third. Yeah, Shady isn't doing terrible in the game. Doing pretty good in this way. This is another big run. And he would have run ahead of touch on this game. Scores. Sherman knows what they're about. The running game that. worked in that situation. I'll continue to go in that direction. Here we go. One, They'll throw on first down. With oh, Taylor. I'm missing the problem. Right and on the other one. A big play here for the Bills. As quick as possible. Bobby Wagner has to be one of the fastest running backs in the NFL. Take off and go. And how about the end result? Big time run after catch yardage. That rack yardage is so valuable for any offense. This will be caught just inside the ten. Call it a gain of five, and it'll be a 
second down. I'm going to be careful Get him out in the he flat scores. This is a, a chance to make people miss one score game field. at that point. And I feel like he's not even good enough to be within that, that range. You know? A fake to McCoy. Now it's Taylor. And he's picked off. Trying for Brown and it's intercepted. That was, uh, it's the Pro Bowl quarterback, Oh, Richard and Schumann. he got the animation that made him go backwards. I actually wanted to stay so in the end zone, but then it looked like I stepped out, so I'm like, I might as well start running now. After this. Very tough spot here for the offense to start. And I just had to run it to get out of the end zone, and Wilson not doing too hard. So Rawls breaks one tackle, and he's gone. Just like that. That starts a showboat, and the, yeah. I started to show that they even go for animation. Some animations that make you go a little faster and you're just gloating in the end zone. But then there's animations like that. Control. Make you go down to like walk basically. And what makes it that much more impressive for me is that if you're on defense, you're going to walk it again. 97 yards. people risking throwing it. So you expect them to do exactly what they did, yet it still breaks for 97 yards. That's so right now, it holds is unstoppable. Try to shake off the interception. He'll look to throw. Jermaine, Jermaine Brock with a shutdown coverage. Toes. That's why they haven't had much success on the scoreboard. Anytime he gets beat, he's not, it's not noticed because he never looks that way. So whenever he's actually having good coverage. And then he's looking directly at him. And he'll get it up to the 33 yard line. An important third down. Third and two, now Taylor. I might be really just one to look my way because I had great coverage. The only time I had a really great coverage in this probably entire game. In their own territory on fourth down, and they're going to go for it. They and I allow that. And he's got his man. It's the tight end Clay. I really thought it was coming because that's what most play, people do. It was just in to. Madden history, but down. I didn't protect against it. Throwing now, Taylor on and first that's not my fault, but it's really my fault. I really should have pressed him. Let's see if they defense maybe on their heels. I'm still trying to figure this guy out, folks. I mean, his drives are not unstoppable. But he has these nice little plays here and there that really keep him like relevant and give him hope in his game. That's probably why he's not left yet. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, I missed that. Thank you, Roger Reiner. I had terrible time. I'm surprised he's not on the ball and doing that too well. Third and long, it's Taylor. Yeah. And that is incomplete. Why did this? you not pick that? Bobby Ryan is not in perfect position to pick it, and then he bats it away. And then now he's actually hating it because he's got it away. Come on. They'll try and throw for it with Taylor. And they will not be able to hook up there. Wow. It's incomplete. For some, for some reason, he's not like that bad. He, he had no reason to drop that. And this defense is going to get the football back near midfield. No, I kind of understand why he didn't go into the First down, this is Rawls. Takes this to the 45. Got a little space after that nice move. Now before the second down play, we'll get whistles we'll and a timeout. We'll sit on the other end and like, as the stoppage will come with 23 like seconds to go till halftime. Two yards to go here on second down for the offense. Wilson has been, well, I haven't thrown it much either, to be honest, but like. From the gun, it's Wilson. Just, just look at Wilson. Flushed out right, and he can't get rid of it. He's taken down. And he's sacked. And now maybe they want some extra time to talk about this third and long play as we'll get a timeout. As they stop it with 16 seconds to go in half number one. His defense the isn't terrible. I mean, in coverage, the they're doing pretty pretty well out there, which is actually surprising considering they lost so many secondary players. But. And. This pro size is going nowhere. That's my fault. And it'll be fourth down. It's almost gotten to the point in the NFL where third down is a throwing down, no matter what the distance. It's I have to punt this, and honestly, so I hate any play where I have to depend on him to find the 
take a play. Finally decide on something. Because I wait for home, three days. But they become disruptors. Actually getting back there, making a big play, big loss. And now they flip the balance of the field for the team. On is the punter Ryan to send this one away. And that was a that bad kick. He could return this pretty easily. That's it for the first half. They think just they were just bad plays to call. Let's get a little return there for him. Quickly here, if they felt they had something going, but they just need to do it a little bit better or not. And he gets the ball all after half. His drives are very time consuming, so I will give him credit on that. And he doesn't chew clock, he literally just takes his time. And I almost get to him there, and then he gets it off too fast. And Tremaine Brock with the hit. I think this is a stretch. That's what he wanted me to do. Tremaine Brock again. Dropping blocks, making plays. And again, you gotta love the run game with two balls. Ooh, and if I would have cut it up field, I probably would have won the touchdown. Nine rushes, 253 yards, two touchdowns. Would have been three touchdowns, but. You know. Is that negative six passing yards? Wilson complete one pass for me. Ooh, and he got popped. Nick Vanett with the drop. <laughs> it's a wonder why that pass didn't really get completed unless he did some hot routes or something. Uh, I can't even get to my running back. Two yards, one for four for two yards. Now a whistle, and I think a penalty here for a delay. No, they're going to say timeout. They... And that was just a product. He had to call the timeout because he takes so much time to call his play. You know what I mean? This I can tell you he's going to run post or something. Over the middle, but it's and it was fun. Second down here after the incomplete pass. They didn't give me the animation like I hit him. It looks like he just dropped it. He just got close to Bobby Wagner and ended up dropping the ball. To throw again, Taylor. And he drops it incomplete. Destroyed the third down. A pretty woeful 0 for 5 thus far. This is third and 10. Williams. Okay, there we go. It's Williams. He gets pops. And the Seahawks have picked it up. The psychology of the game. Bobby Wagner is so amazing because. You would think there would never be a... Yet they are humans out there running around. And we just saw another one. Opportunistic by the defense. I feel like this play should work. No other plays have really worked. I haven't even really, like... This is the closest to a drive I've had. Other than the run. And I just picked. Okay. Get him, Wilson. Get him, Wilson. Wilson with the burners. Wow. I mean, really, in reality, we'll say we're not that bad that home, but after I saw the Richard Sherman, like, spread out, slip and fly dives happen, I feel like that should have worked right there. He rolls again, 10 rushes, 3 minutes, 59 yards. 3 take lines. The Bills are... The Bills defense is really the same right and my defense is my favorite defense. It's a game well, of four there and it gives Wilson has not done anything, and I honestly don't have any really good drives, and T.L. Well fumbles, and Wilson picks it up. Wilson does have a rest CD, that's why they pulled up that stat, so I never forget. But a teammate comes along and scoops yeah, it. That's like so long to throw and everything. I could blame Wilson, but it's really easy. That's the sad truth in this game. You always know, hear people talking about their players. I mean, I'm not even busy with players, but most of the time do. Doug Bowman getting pressed way out there. And he's actually making the catch. Yeah, this is, this is Seahawks football. He's a speed to his advantage. 
and go up and get the football. That's a big time play right there. Just, and the play just throwing out. Someone's down the pocket. One of these times. And for one of the few times here today, this run's not going to go anywhere. I'm actually, I, I don't know why I threw that as opposed to some of the easy throws that you see me miss. <laughs> they go again with Rawls. I really love him too. And the Seahawks on third down. And I'm going back to once in four tries. This is third and seven. Time running out here on the play clock. And I'm sacking him. Good for you, Shaq Lawson. They're going to get him as he goes down. Shaq Lawson. Is that word again symptomatic? Yeah. I like that. And that pump there. Is symptomatic of the success of this broadcast. And you know there's a like weak corner boy for this work. I just kept using it. <laughs> Look at Tremaine Block. Now the pressure comes and he goes down. Just inside the 10, back at the 9. Man, that was actually a really good play. I like that play. You see he's that play in the older Madden's. The little PA4 play. He's the PA5. Second down, Taylor. And that's easily played. This is intercepted. And that should I don't know what you're reading off of. A great read and it's picked off. And his guys are going to get the football at the 23-yard line. We'll start this back to running the ball. <laughs> very good field position. That's honestly all I know in this game. <laughs> They'll run it now out of the gun. They also and talk about mobile quarterbacks being run. really OP. Nice in the long shot, throwing them. Oh, my gosh, that's, um, like, whenever you're playing high school, Devin Wade, keep the ball on the ground, right? this is where it's pretty the OP with the running the ball, ball. Taking care but... Of the ball. I mean, terms not so much online from what I've seen him, like, at least not with my ultimate team, this is my first online game. game. The ultimate team, I mean, trying to run with Andy Dalton is terrible, trying to run with Dan Marino is even worse. I, I think he has a 40 speed in the game. Like, it'd be faster to probably roll out of the pocket with Carson Palmer. Now I'm just going to try to run out the clock and just end this game. Because, I mean, it's obviously really dumb. But look at T. Walls getting the outside. Dive! And he loses the football to set. Oh, okay. And he fumbled and went out of bounds, thankfully. They come out here in the eye. And he's pretty heavy on this. I think he's thinking I'm doing a QB sneak. So hopefully he'll get the same. Yeah, nope. Goal. That is not going to be any help as they dump it behind the holes. 286 I can't complain. huge for him. Kind of like a baseball hitter. In the I mean, zone. it's not really the worth it, but I'm going to pass the ball just with Anyways, guys, guys they've got to go. Down. And he's got the big tight end, Graham. Touchdown, Seattle. Just struggled. Do they try to put together something here at the end just to take it? Oh, yeah, if you guys like this, yeah, this, this um, me playing just online on games and, and we were losing late in the talking to Henry and Dr. Team and everything, just let me know. And and know. And I mean, it I mean, it was actually, other than waiting for this guy to pick a play, and it took probably, like, the entire freaking clock for him to pick a play. It was pretty fun. I liked it. And this is the only online game that I played so much. This was yeah, he is going to be knocked on third three days, yeah. down. They're struggling. 0 for 6 thus far. This is third and, and four. This is going to be his last play, I believe. Now Taylor to throw. Start getting in there. Bobby Wagner is going to switch it. And then Bobby Wagner eventually gets the foul. Here as he's taken down. Bobby Wagner in there to get him his second sack. Now in the so, yeah, that was the end of the game. So, subscribe and like for more videos.